Hello and welcome to Iraqi Dinar News. Today is June 4th, 2024, and we've got some exciting developments to cover regarding the Central Bank of Iraq's latest auction and the ongoing speculations about the potential revaluation, RV, of the Iraqi Dinar. Earlier today, the Central Bank of Iraq, or CBI, held an auction where they sold over $278 million. This is a significant figure and continues to fuel discussions and rumors about the possibility of an RV. In this video, we'll break down the details of this auction, what it means for the Iraqi dinar, and how it might impact you. First, let's dive into the specifics of today's auction. According to Shafak News Agency, the CBI sold a total of 278,833,388 dollars. This auction was covered at two different exchange rates, 1,305 dinars per dollar for documentary credits and international settlements of electronic cards, and 1,310 dinars per dollar for foreign transfers and cash transactions. The difference in rates is a standard practice by the CBI to manage various forms of transactions. What's particularly noteworthy is how the sales were divided. Out of the total amount, a whopping $255,513,388 was allocated to foreign balances in the form of transfers and credit transactions. In contrast, only $23,320,000 was designated for cash deals. This imbalance suggests a strong focus on stabilizing and managing foreign currency reserves, which is critical in the context of any potential RV. Four banks participated in the cash deals, while nine banks handled the foreign balance transactions. Additionally, 119 exchange and brokerage companies were involved in the auction. This broad participation indicates a robust and active financial market in Iraq, which is essential for any significant currency valuation adjustments. Now, let's address the elephant in the room, the potential revaluation of the Iraqi dinar. The concept of an RV has been a hot topic among investors and economists for years. The recent auction activities, combined with Iraq's ongoing economic reforms, have rekindled these speculations. Why is an RV such a big deal? A revaluation means that the value of the Iraqi dinar would increase significantly compared to other currencies, particularly the US dollar. This could have profound implications for the Iraqi economy and for anyone holding Iraqi dinars. Proponents argue that an RV could attract foreign investment, stabilize the economy, and enhance Iraq's global financial standing. Critics, however, caution that such a move could be risky and might lead to inflation if not managed carefully. Today's auction results show that the CBI is taking calculated steps to manage its currency reserves and foreign balances. By focusing more on remittances and credit transactions rather than cash sales, the bank seems to be preparing for larger financial movements. This could be a part of a broader strategy to create a more stable and attractive economic environment, possibly setting the stage for an RV. So, what should we watch for next? Keep an eye on the CBI's future auctions and any official statements regarding currency policies. Also, monitor Iraq's broader economic indicators, such as inflation rates, foreign investment levels, and overall economic growth. These factors will provide clues about whether an RV is becoming more likely. In conclusion, today's auction by the Central Bank of Iraq, with over $278 million sold, highlights significant movements in the country's financial landscape. While an RV is still speculative, the actions taken by the CBI suggest a careful and strategic approach to managing the Iraqi dinar. As always, stay informed and cautious with your investments. Thank you for watching Iraqi Dinar News. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for the latest updates on the Iraqi economy and currency. See you next time.